Hi guys, and today we're gonna to be taking a look at how we can get some really, really fast path trace renders using a dual RTX 4090 setup. So I'm currently using two RTX 4090 graphics cards. As you can see up here, you know, we've got both of those graphics cards, both with 24 gigabyte of VRAM available. And guys, this is incredible in the actual Omniverse because you can use dual graphics cards to actually render and get some super fast render time. So currently you can see I've got my path tracing set to 512 samples, but let's just up that a little bit. I'm gonna go into my path tracing here and we're gonna increase this to 1,500 samples. I'm gonna hit enter. And now you can see guys how fast that moves. You know, we're nearly a thousand and you know, at 1500, we're looking at about under 20 seconds, as you can see there, guys. I mean, that is phenomenal. If you think about kind of a software like Maya or 3ds Max, you know, not even looking at a path trace, you're looking at maybe a minute and a half, two minutes per frame. In something like NVIDIA Omniverse, to get 17.6 seconds, with 1,500 samples is just insane. And you can see the image here, guys. It looks incredible. It looks really, really awesome. And again, just a really cool setup that some of you might wanna think about when kind of building your computers is just getting that dual graphics card set in your computers to get some incredible render times. So I'm actually gonna render this out so we can actually take a look at the rendered image. And uh, what we'll do is we'll just actually render this out at about 1500 samples again, and we'll capture that in our folder here. So I'm just gonna change the name. We'll change it to maybe robot. And I'm just gonna come up here and make sure I've got the RTX setting set correct. So we'll just check, we're in real time currently. So we're just gonna change this to path tracing. And I'm gonna use the samples per pixel because we're using dual GPUs, we can actually change this to a value of about eight to speed up that render time. But this is gonna be effectively using two graphics cards to render this out. So the speed is phenomenal. Now let's just look very quickly at the difference in speed. So I'm just gonna click on the image here and just uh, move in ever so slightly and move back out. And that's gonna reset the time. So you can see here, we got a render of 17.6 something seconds. So I'm gonna go into my settings very quickly and I'm gonna change this to, I'm gonna turn off the multi GPU render and we'll see how quick it actually moves with just one graphics card. So I'm just gonna turn this off. You can see now we're getting it a bit faster even at 16 seconds, but I'll turn off the multi render. And now we'll see how long that takes to actually path trace at 1,500 samples. But you can see already guys, it's a lot slower. Uh, we're only at 510 seconds already. And uh, you can see, you know, just having that dual RTX graphics cards, it just speeds up that time by a phenomenal amounts. We're at 23 seconds and we've still got samples to go. And you can see here, we're nearing the end now, but we're gonna come in at about 30 seconds as you can see. So we're effectively, with two graphics cards, we're actually getting double the render speed. So, you know, if time is money, this is a phenomenal way to really save your time by having these dual GPU setups. Now let's actually render this out. So I'm gonna change the path trace here to 1,500 samples, and we're just gonna render this in real time so we can see how long that takes. So I'm just gonna capture the current frame. Okay, now we've got it to 1,500 samples, so that's perfect. But again, you can see in real time, it's even a little bit more quicker. It's actually moving a lot, lot quicker. So we're gonna head into about 14 or 15 seconds, perfect. So you can see that was 14 seconds, guys, with a real time render. And let's just open up that image and actually check it out. We can go into the, I'll just copy and paste the location here. I'll close this and I'm just gonna open up my Explorer here and we'll just check that image and just see how that looks. But again, here we are with our robot render. But guys, you can see that looks incredible. 14 seconds to render out an image with 1,500 samples is absolutely mind blowing. I truly mean, you know, render times at this speed are just, <laughs> 
they're just a thing of the future, guys. It really is an incredible, incredible speed. So just a quick look at what two RTX 4090 graphics cards can do with a dual setup when you're working in NVIDIA Omniverse. Hope to see you guys again soon for more awesome content.